Hello. Welcome to a mukbang with Chocolumpia. What's up, Chocolumpia Lessons Tribe? It is Chocolumpia of Chocolumpia Lessons. We just had to get that traditional intro in there. I am doing this because this is my most requested video. Today, I will be eating some sushi. I'm super excited about it. Maybe I'll just have whatever sounds happen during the mukbang be the ASMR. So mukbang and unintentional ASMR or purposeful intentional ASMR. What? It's whatever. Welcome. I'm going to have a little sip of carbonated water. Not sponsored. All right, so let's talk about what we have here. We have some salmon nigiri, tuna nigiri. There's some brown rice sushi here with salmon on the inside, avocado, and also tuna. My mouth is watering. I'm so excited to eat this. I have my wasabi, wasabi, with lots and lots of it because I like when it tingles. Like I like the feeling of it tingling from the back of the base of my skull <gasps> all the way forward into my nose. And then when my eyes start watering and then potentially I sneeze, that's my favorite. I don't know why. It's just, I like it. So I guess that's, that's another type of ASMR. It's just through eating and, um, for my face, <laughs> my nasal cavity. Ginger, excuse me, I don't know why I'm, bur oh, you know why I'm burping? It's because of the carbonated water. It's a bad idea, that's fine. Ginger, and then lastly, this is a spicy salmon roll with, it looks like cucumbers on the inside. I couldn't remember what was on the inside because I was just really excited about the salmon because I love salmon. They did kind of douse it with a lot of the sriracha and mayo combo, that's okay. We're gonna eat it, it's gonna be great. I'm gonna do a little sample test of the wasabi. Wasabi, do you guys, have you seen the, the YouTube clip with the little girl and she eats wasabi and it's like, it's so funny but it's also sad. Mmm. Ooh, there's that tingle. It just kind of like slowly creeps. Mmm, so good. I love it. Do you guys like spicy wasabi? Or not spicy wasabi, wasabi is spicy, but do you like it? Tell me in the comments. Tell me if you use a lot or if you don't use any. I love it. Mm. So good. Shout out to my cousin for getting me this dish plate combo. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh my lord. <laughs> that was a big one. Oh man. My eyes are watering. Oh, I love it. I think I got a like a chunk. Okay, so what I was saying. <laughs> my cousin bought me these cool plates a hundred years ago. And I just held them and never used them. And it's really cute because there's like the green. Um... <clears throat> Why can't I think, uh, what's the name of the thing when it goes from the gradient from like lighter color to darker color? I'm thinking biolage, but that's hair. I can't, maybe that's not even what it's called. I can't think of what it's called right now. <laughs> My brain is still like, woo, from that wasabi. 
Sorry if you are listening with headphones because I just <clears throat> yelled. This is probably going to be intense again, but wish me luck. Here we go. It always takes a second. Mm. No. I think I just got lucky with a really big chunk that time. <clears throat> a wasabi chunk. Mm, you can hear the ginger, it's crunchy. So good. Kind of want a little bit more soy sauce. Let's see. I'm going to try this guy. Cucumber in the middle. I almost just dropped that. That would have been really sad. <gasps> A little dunky dunk. Mm. I like it. It's like fresh. The sauce isn't too saucy. It's not too mayo -y. sriracha. It's actually a nice blend. Usually when I get sushi, I try not to get too much saucy stuff because I like actually tasting the fish. Except for when I dip it in the wasabi and then the um, soy sauce. Mmm. So good. Well, I can breathe. Do one of these. Tuna. Mm hmm? Ooh, that one just stayed on my tongue. Like my tongue felt burnt after that one, but it didn't radiate through my head. That second one, oh man, I think that was the second bite. That was so good. So imagine, I like to eat like that for every bite when I'm having sushi. So I usually need like a nap after, because I'm so <laughs> tired out. Okay, another one of these guys. Mm. Mm -hmm. Woo, it's another one. It's mostly staying here though, the heat. Mm, so good. I love sushi. I could eat it every day. Even my dishes match. Isn't that cute? Why did I wait like five years to use that? Mm. You guys ever go shopping in your own house? Forget about stuff that you bought or you either got as a gift and then Mmm. Surprise. New dishware. Mmm. So good. I have rice in my wasabi now, that's fine. all gonna end up in the same place, right? Oh. <sighs> I think I need more soy sauce, you guys. Mm-hmm.
So I got a little more wasabi and a little bit more soy sauce. I think this one's gonna hurt. <laughs> it's fine. Now, yeah, we're probably, we're probably stronger than we were initially. Ooh, okay. I also brought over some seaweed just because I love seaweed. So here's some package ASMR, which you may not want to hear. So if that's you, plug your ears or take your headphones off. I really like this brand. Sea veggies. Yang bam. I'm just gonna have a couple. Mm. Oh, I could eat seaweed all day, honestly. This is so good. Just kind of a little palate cleanser in between. Some seaweed ASMR. Sometimes I'll just find like seaweed chunks on my couch. You're like, where, where do you, where do you find your seaweed chunks? On my couch, okay? <laughs> mm, I love it so much. I know I keep saying it, it's so good. Okay. Well, sorry, if you were doing ASMR there, I apologize. I'm still new at this, okay? Obviously. No one's saying that I'm I'm an ASMR artist. An ASMR artist. Profesional. I just love it and appreciate it. And um, want to contribute. Okay, here's another. This is the first one of the new batch. I think, I think, I think we're going to die, you guys, but... Me waiting for it. And then everything's fine. Cool. I like it. I also use low sodium soy sauce just to help out where I can. I think it tastes better. Mm. And the sun coming in. Woo! That was more of a tongue one, though. It's weird. It's more mouthy this time. It's not doing the, like behind my head it feels like someone's massaging your scalp it's not doing that that's okay we got that one big one and that was awesome it's kind of like a falling star <laughs> getting those unless you just really don't put any soy sauce in it at all but I like the taste of soy sauce Salmon nigiri is my favorite. Mm -hmm. So is tuna though. I like all sushi. Only kind I don't really eat. 
I'm not really that big on the tamago. And that's the egg. I'm not so big on that. Mm. I like squid. I like shrimp. Mmm. I'm not a, a masago person either. Which is weird because I'll eat caviar. I know it's different, but um, just something about the big gelatinous eggs. Maybe just eggs in general. I know I probably shouldn't be talking about stuff that I don't like eating while I'm doing a mukbang, but I feel like since we're chatting it up, here's this one. <laughs> so yeah, I don't really eat the egg. Rarely do I eat regular egg. I have to have a craving for it. Oh, my goodness. Hmm. So good. I do really like this one. Do a little dunky dunk. I feel like I still want more soy sauce. <laughs> mm -hmm. Soy sauce everywhere. I had to get more soy sauce because I was running out <clears throat> and it didn't taste very wasabi-ish anymore anyway. So we have more sauce, more sauce. Mm, okay. Three of these guys left. Dunky dunk. <clears throat> so good. My chopstick keeps hitting the back of <laughs> my tooth. one. This one was actually fresher than I imagined it was going to be. Oh no, don't fall. Because of all the sauce, I was nervous that it was just going to be so saucy. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Messy bite for the last one. Mm. 
so good. Does anyone else rub their thighs when they eat? When it's really yummy, I rub my thighs. I don't know why, I've just always done that. I don't know. Anyways, thanks for joining me. <laughs> Bye. Mm. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Tell me what you want to see, more stuff. New channel, so I'm just trying to add more stuff, more content. Thank you. Bye.